Also at the House of Representatives Minority Caucus met in Abuja on Tuesday to forge a common cause as the battle over who leads the 10th Legislative Assembly gathers momentum. The meeting is at the instance of the old members of the opposition parties led by the People's Democratic Party, PDP. Plus TV News' Emmanuel Ehijena has the report. The race for the leadership of the 10th National Assembly, particularly the Green Chamber, may have just started with the opposition rallying support from the newly elected House of Representatives members representing seven political parties under the auspices of the Minority Caucus. The meeting is at the instance of old members led by Honorable Frederick Agbede, calling on the rep members elect to forge a strong alliance that will put the ruling party on their toes. Not only to represent our people, but see Nigeria as one constituency where our contributions should make life meaningful to all. This session is to enable us to network, interact, and familiarize ourselves as people that the results of 2023 general election are thrown up as a new face, having numbers that gives us greater strength to deepen opposition politics and democracy. In the response, representatives of the seven opposition parties pledged commitment and cooperation amongst the political parties, irrespective of the security of ratio of the alliance. I believe that we are all minorities coming together for common purpose to stand firm for overall benefit of us, irrespective of seniority, considering also the ratio in the alliance. <laughs> I stand here on behalf of 34 strong, vibrant member elect of LP, believing that this bonding shall attract even mutual benefit to us in this 10th assembly. We must unite. If we do not unite, they say a house divided against itself cannot stand. With unity, we can accomplish a lot. Harmony, peace, progress, and we can not only empower our constituencies and our constituents, those whom we look up to, but we can ensure that we play our role as a vibrant opposition. For us to be able to put through our collective interests, for us to be able to protect our ideals as minority parties that fundamentally serves as a check to the ruling party, for us to be able to contribute to nation building, we must come together. We've all been called for a common purpose. And what is that purpose? The purpose for a better Nigeria. And that is why we've all been duly, by divine providence, elected to represent our various constituencies. According to INEC, so far, 324 members have won a seat to the House of Representatives, with APC having 162 seats, PDP 102, Labour Party 34, and NPP 18, ABGA 4, while both ADC and SDP won two seats each, and YPP won seats. Supplementary elections are expected to be conducted in 33 federal constituencies on the 15th of April 2023. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.